about violence along the border have more drivers looking for increased protection. A Houston car company says it's been flooded with calls from people wanting to turn their cars into these armored vehicles. 11 is Puerto Vicente Arena shows us how it's done. At Tex Caliber Armor, you'll find cars that even James Bond would envy. Some have smoke screens, road tacks, signal jammers, and thick sheets of metal and glass. Well, this is where it starts right here. Tex Caliber takes regular cars like this SUV and turns them into armored vehicles right here in Houston. Here, Tex Caliber workers will actually test their glass and steel with an assault weapon like this one. This is an AR-10. It's considered by many a weapon of choice. The thick glass stopped the test bullet in its tracks. Right. And it's like a steel cage in there. It's just nothing but steel it's, all it, the way around. It is, it is, the best way to put it, it's, it's a cocoon of steel is what it is. Tex Caliber has made cars that are being used in foreign hotspots like Iraq and Afghanistan. The company says business is booming. That was especially true after the terrorist attacks in India last year. I'm sorry, as soon as that happened over in those hotels, um, our phone was ringing off the wall. Tex Caliber says it's also getting business from Mexico, where drug violence and kidnappings make headlines every day. A lot of inquiries, a lot of inquiries, especially from uh, government agencies. The company says its customers prefer armoring SUVs, pickup trucks, and Jeeps. Uh, this vehicle's B6 protection, which is going to stop your high power um, assault rifles as well as grenade attacks underneath it. The armor can cost anywhere from forty to a hundred and fifteen thousand dollars but customers spare no expense when it comes to protecting themselves. In Northwest Houston, Vicente Arenas, 11